24 people lost their lives here in Graves County. You can see a memorial set up here right next to me in the city center. And we spoke with one family who describes Robert Daniel as a hero. Robert Daniel's family describes him as a great father who had a good heart. He was just present in all of our lives. So big moments, small moments, grandkids, it did not matter. As a Graves County Jailer, Robert had been assigned to oversee the work release program at the Mayfield Candle Factory, where several inmates worked. The night the tornado hit was Robert's first day in that position. He gave me my Christian present early that day, and he's telling me, man, I start this job at night, I work night shift, and uh... Once the tornado hit, Zachary Daniel says no one had heard from his dad. Me, I went out there to go try to find him. When I got there, you know, I was looking around like, there's no way. Zachary and his family found out hours later, Robert didn't make it. Employees at the candle factory tell the Daniel family, Robert saved seven inmates that night. Spending his last moments rescuing others. What do you miss most about him? Our conversations, a little, our, we had man, a little routine going on with our breakfast mornings, you know. I miss everything, like he was really my best friend, so yeah, one of my best friends, man. Zachary says he misses going to games with his dad and their Christmas traditions. If you could say something to your dad right now, what would you say? <laughs> I don't want to say what I want to say. I mean, uh, I miss you, Pop. Say, I miss you. We miss you. The Graves County Sheriff's Office honored Robert with a life-saving award for his heroic efforts. Reporting in Mayfield, I'm Amanda Chen, Fox 17 News, your Code Red Station.